Uh, Cerberus? You want to throw your most important boy the galaxy has ever fucking seen? Like, just a little bit of a bone? Please, please, bone me fucking harder. I'm useless at this point. I've absolutely been defanged if I don't have money. I can't buy fucking guns. To the Normandy we go, I guess. A little bit less built in the Citadel than I expected. Um, in fact, in fact, in fact, in fact, in fact, we're gonna look up a, 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 uh, a few side missions real quick, I think, just to make sure I didn't miss anything. Uh, Citadel side missions. And I'm sure there'll be more down the line, I just, I, I'm not there yet. So I should probably make sure I haven't missed any Omega ones, right? SMG shield piercing! Fuck, that's good, that's really, really good, okay. Oh, friend, what the hell is this? No, this is Mass Effect 1. I specified to Google. Why do I even hire you? Mr. Google's a fucking idiot. Uh, blah, 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 blah. There you go. That's a walkthrough. I don't want to walk th ah! through my fucking phone at my genitals. Sorry about that sound. No one needed that. Oh, the horrible, damp squish that came from... Losing my manhood, and also, the scream. <laughs> that was a terrible, terrible squeal. Ah, uh, yeah, we did that, we did that, we did that, we did that, we did that. We did that, we did that, we did that, we did that, we did that. We cannot go there yet, okay. Omega side quests, Mass Effect 2, there we go. I don't normally like to do this, as you guys know, but I feel like it's 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 worth doing when I know that we could accidentally miss things. If we do end up missing things, I will weep. I will weep so fucking hard. Uh, so we fucked the Batarian bartender, bartender in all, all of his little skull holes. Missing a system, we dealt with that. Oh, you know what we know what we didn't do. Wait, help Kasumi? That's in this galaxy. I mean, I'd love to do that, but right now, there's something I'll forget to do. Uh, we found ourselves a data pad incriminating someone very, 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 very hardcore on Omega. And if we can get Arya as an ally this early in the game, that should be able to help us down the line with other things, even off, uh, even off world. Even off the, uh, world's only space-worthy sex toy. There we go. Can I skip this? We've been to Omega many, many times. We know what it's like. We know how to dock with the ultimate sex toy. Uh, let's keep going. It's gonna be Garrison Morden for a while. I don't- Oh, but we do have Kasumi now. Oh, throw. Let's grab throw. Why do I have, like, one point? Where did that come from? I'm just stupid and didn't use it last time? Damn, I'm good. I'm so fucking... I, I don't understand how I'm this bad sometimes. I don't understand how I just don't notice things. You're gonna tell us that absolutely every time? What you gotta say, Garrus? Come on, let me in. And then I'm just showing him up? We just dragged Archangel right fucking back here and going to the probably the biggest breeding ground for all criminals in the world. So much illegal fucking going on in here. And not even the good kind, not even the fun kind. Ah, uh, Arya, 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 Arya. I brought you your two best friends, causing all the problems in the world down here. Did you like Archangel? What was the situation here? What do you need? Take a look at this data pad, Arya. This data pad was on one of the mercs. Why'd I sit road down road. if I was only gonna do that? I'm coming for you next. Shepard, the master of our space Easy. power place. I am Osmega. Interesting. Would someone like to tell me how this information slipped the net? <laughs> Poor Batari just had to I'll take it. it. He Thanks was trying to be intimidating touch. before. Looks like I'll have to do a little cleaning in my organization. But he clearly gets cock stomped day by day. That was it. All right. Okay, well, you're on my side now, though. Later. You do that. 40 XP. Am I getting some money? No. No, of course Arya I'm not. Has a job she needs doing. Oh, here we go. I knew. <laughs> what the hell is that? Garrus fucked an Ewok, and this is the result. That depends on what Arya. Wrong franchise, Garrus. Get your cock out of there. Tiny face. Acquaintance of hers, a Krogan named Patriarch. She'd like you to keep that from happening. 
And why do we want to kill the Patriarch? What's the Blood Pack's problem? If he's called Patriarch, that means he's a Krogan with a lot of kids. He might be one of the few very fertile ones, but the Solarian curse didn't work on. don't appreciate his story, especially when he dips into non-fiction. Non-fiction? So is this potent cock in the world of fiction? Or why do they call him this? And why protect the Patriarch? What's Arya's interest in protecting him? Patriarch was one of her deadliest enemies back in the old days. Now she keeps what's left of him around as a trophy. Oh, that's so Poor cruel. Poor little Krogan. You go up against Arya. Why ask me? Why come to me? Arya's usual muscle not up for the job? Because Arya said so. What other reason do you need? The real reason. Uh, you know what? You know what? This is a criminal fucking organization. I might as well be renegading. I swing my massive galactic quality cock around. They might just respect me a little more. Tell me, or I walk. If Arya wants my help, she'd better tell me why. I'm not doing this for my help. Fine. Whatever gets you to take the job. If it gets out that Arya's protecting Patriarch, well, that can look like a weakness. And some people might want to exploit that. You know, Doesn't look like a weakness. You helping Patriarch just seems like a random act of kindness. Huh? But I am gonna be on a fucking payroll. She better be paying me for this. I'm not doing this out of like the kindness of my fucking heart. I'm doing this to make my galactic coat become universal. Ah. Uh... Fuck it. I'll do it. I like interacting with cute little Krogan. I'll look into it. Good. Patriarch's downstairs, likely surrounded by his fans. Get him into hiding until the mercs move on. Come back here when it's done, and you'll get your due. I'll be, I'll be back. back when the job is done. Good luck. Cool. I like, I like. I don't think we're gonna do it yet, though. As much as I want to clear up Omega, there's someone I want with me before I, uh, I interact with any kind of patriarch. And I'm very, very excited to... <laughs> oh, God, man. I can't... I can't contain my excitement. Like, when I'm playing this game, there is a fucking, the biggest, a maniacal, probably psychiatrical, psychiatrically worrying smile plastered across my face at all times. Like, the only way that this smile could get any bigger if, if, if it was a Joker kind of fucking smile. But no, but no, right now my lips are still intact, although they are being stretched to breaking point. Thank you, Mass Effect, you fucking arseholes. And honestly, once we recruit the man in question... Commander, you received a new oh, message at your private terminal. Okay, fucking cool. I hope he doesn't die. I hope the fucking patron... You're not dead, Emily Wong. You and Garrus are alive. Chloe Michelle! There you go, I missed you. I guess I got this from hanging around on the Citadel for a while. Uh, what? She's French. I can't do a French accent. Uh, I'll do the... Uh, no, I'm full of fucking tree cum. The jizz blizzard is never-ending. As, um, summer continues, even if there is a massive fucking rainstorm right now. By the way, orange flood warning. We went from, like, <laughs> tropical fucking blaze. Like, my skin literally boiling while it's still attached to me. Delicious, by the way. I make some fine fucking man jerky. Um, but yeah, we went from that to <laughs> a tropical fucking rainstorm. Except without the heat, it's actually quite cold now. But genuinely, like, low down area, like people at the bottom of hills and shit, their houses are underwater almost entirely. Oh no, it's only like an orange flood warning. But it's still pretty rough. A couple Xboxes probably got soaked. That's a lot of people, a lot of money. Although apparently you can really fuck insurance companies with that, so... Hint, hint, if any of my viewers happen to currently be in a natural disaster, I'm sure that's, I'm sure that's definitely happening. Uh, dear Commander Shepard, that's not French, that's Tali. I was relieved to hear that you were alive. I was devastated to hear of the destruction of the Normandy. And those people didn't make it off in time. After you went missing and were presumed dead, I feared I'd never see you or Garrus again. You and he did so much to help clean up the wards when you were hunting for Saren. The galaxy needs more people like you. And I'm glad that you're still here to protect those of us that have grown to depend on both of you. Is Garrus with you again by any chance? After being so happy to hear of your survival, I wondered if perhaps he might have ended up with you. I left a few messages on his public accounts, but you know how he is about checking his mail. Too busy with those fucking calibrations, I'm sure. Callan and Brayden so fucking hard. Um, I don't think the com address I had for him works anymore, because he hasn't returned my calls 
always so busy on his grand crusades and great passions that he focuses on them to the exclusion of anything or anyone else? Anyone, if you... Anyway, if you know where he might be, I would really love to hear from him. Or both of you could come by the next time you're near the Citadel. Thanks. Absolutely, we're gonna go see Michelle. Although, Garrus was right. Everyone is hitting on Garrus and not me. How dare you? Ah, a gift of... <laughs> Shaira! That gave me goosebumps just to read Gift of Words again, because that is, um... So when I first played with Mass Effect 1, I didn't used to do nearly as long of, uh, uh recording sessions. I probably go for a max of, like, two hours, because back then my voice couldn't take it, because I was a tiny baby boy. Um, but now we go for, like, nine hours, and it's absolutely insane half the time. But... Gift of Words? It's probably the last line I ever heard in, like, the first session of my original Mass Effect series. And for some reason, it's just always stuck with me, and that makes me happy. Manda, I thought that my gift of words had been incorrect. An embarrassing notion. My contacts tell me that you yet survive. I am pleased to hear that your journey continues. Though I sense that you head towards an even deeper darkness. When you fought Saren, only your resolve was tested. Now I fear you cannot rely on your own strength. Take whatever steps you must to ensure that those battling at your side fight with clear minds and glad hearts. Be well, Consort Shaira. Meaning do everyone's fucking loyalty missions, you selfish cunt. Obviously I will, because for once, I'm not going to be a selfish cunt in a video game. I know, I know. Who would have ever guessed? God, you're all women. Three women voices in a row, and the last one I barely even tried for. This one's going to be even worse. Title, you're not dead. From Emily Wong. The Wang Master, sir. You're alive. How come you broke whatever cover you've been under for two years, but didn't offer an exclusive interview to your favorite reporter? Whenever you come up for air and are ready to talk, let me know. Emily Wong. That voice definitely conveys Wang Master energy. She gets that for the rest of her fucking life. Thank God! Thank all the Christs out there in the galaxy. I'm sure it's a very, very, very common last name now that, like, the humans are spacefaring. It's no longer taboo. You can do whatever you want, because it's basically proof <laughs> he's just a Middle Eastern dwarf. All right. That Kasumi is an interesting addition to the crew. I can see why she's good at her work. She never reveals anything meaningful about herself. Maybe there is it's just nothing meaningful surface. about her at all. It'll be a challenge getting to know who she really is. Anyway, what's up? Let's chat. No, let's not, actually. You don't you. do anything. Back, 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 back. Maybe we'll talk later. I hope so. In fact, can we talk? We got quite a few I'm missions done. Commander. How's the crew doing? Anything I should know. Not anything else? Bye. I'll be here I, so I think anything. you can use her to find out who has loyalty missions available to you. I'm not sure if you can use it to find out, like, if you can pick people up or something? I don't know. I don't know. I do want to see what Joker has to say about, uh, Garrus, though. Commander. How are things in the pit of Kai? I assume everything is going well up here. It was until I started combat. my every move. It won't cock let bat? anything slide. You were deliberately falsifying maintenance reports, Mr. Moreau. Using your cock as a Not baseball bat to hit a bat in the cock. I always round up on task times. It makes us look good when we come in under. Huh, I can actually talk to you. I always round up on task times. Uh, that's it? I mean, fuck it. Let Joker do whatever the hell he wants. I'm gonna be on Joker's side until Edie gets hotter. Harmless self-promotion. Edie can ease off on that. Very well, Shepard. Aw, yeah. she hates oh, me. I win. Joker. <laughs> right, 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 right. Good game. <laughs> Good game. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. He's such a toxic gamer. I assume everything is going well up here. Good for now. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're fucking you muted her again. Can I talk to you, Edie? Yes, I'm sorry. I'm being mean. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. We can't hang out yet. Okay. So there is. Edie gets very cool. I like Edie a lot. I feel like she is just the heart of the Normandy. Like it feels like I'm talking to my fucking ship down the line. I can't wait for you to see how the Vagina Orb becomes one of the greatest things of all time. Hello, Morden. Shepard. I mean, Vagina I Orb already sounds pretty damn good, but you know. Have you got a minute to talk? Later, better. Uh. I think I've cured Joker's condition. Simple treatment would... No, 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 no. <laughs> would cause liver failure. Never mind. I'll start from scratch. Anything else? <laughs> I love that I'll he's trying, work. though. I'll be here if you need me. I mean, surely we can just give him another liver. Like, we, we, we must be out of, like, harness Krogan DNA or whatever. I mean, he might grow a few extra dicks, but, you know, just just stave off the condition fixing. We can snap a few of those off easy. Right, where the hell are we going? 
That is Edie herself, like big What's Edie. This, area of the ship? this is the in addition to interfacing with you. This allows lag free communication. No, I thought maybe I'd be able to talk to the elusive check. man from here, but no. I love how he sets it up as like a VR room as well, so it actually does put me in where the fuck he is. Uh, you got something for me, Jacob? It's been a while. Commander, can I help you with something? Please be interested. I'm more interested in just Already? Uh, Alright, well, Miranda didn't want to talk to us last time. Maybe now? Maybe now is okay? Please? Make friend? Make friend? We be friend now! Yes? Yes? Horrifying fucking biotic god genetic marvel freak lady? Do I have nothing? Why am I poor? You made the collector armor. Made the SMG shield piercing, absolutely. But why can't I do anything else? Fully upgrade a weapon. Oh, it's counting up to it. I thought we had to like fully upgrade seven weapons. But no, there's seven up, uh, seems to be seven upgrades for every single weapon. That's interesting. Prototypes, prototypes, prototypes. No, no, no. That's just the collector armor, I think. Um, that was a 50% shield damage on fucking SMGs. That thing just got so less, so much less shit so fucking quick. I like. Life's of, okay, that's a room. <laughs> I thought I could just turn it off. Ooh. Hello, Kasumi's fucking... Uh, I don't know what to call it. Cabin. It's really pretty. Let's close it up and make everything fucking ugly. Actually, it's somehow still pretty, but we will open it up for now. Whoa, I can get wasted on my own ship just because she exists? Why didn't I know this was here? Why didn't no one tell people were locking me out of my fucking bar room? Rude. Very, very, very rude. You know how much Shepard just loves to torture his own innards. Let's go, let's go. See if we can beat the world record. We've already passed out twice. One was from actual poison, so that doesn't really count. Oh, we can ch I love that you can choose which one you have as well. You can have purple, or you can have red. Can I get drunk? I wonder if getting drunk and talking to Kasumi does anything different. I also feel very rude, just sort of charging in here, <laughs> drinking all her fucking booze without saying a word. I can't remember how she talks. I, I imagine it's somewhat similar to Zaid. I know you can't get in proper conversations with her. Uh, but still, can I mix the drinks together? And make a lovely little Sheppy Supreme? Yes, we can! Yes, we absolutely can! What are the chances this kills me? Not high enough! Oh, it's fizzing. It's- that doesn't look good. That's reacting. That's gaseous. Uh, choke me out, Daddy Booze! Shepard, the men's restroom is on the port side of the ship. <gasps> Does that imply what I think it is? I think Edie's implying that Shepard just pissed himself in Kasumi's little house. Unless it just plays a random dialogue line to confuse you, or the game for some reason thought I was in the women's toilets for a second. No, no, Shepard absolutely just urinated right where he stood. <laughs> and Kasumi definitely heard. Oh, she looks so ashamed to be on this ship. She looks traumatized. All you need is a little bit of rocking back and forth, and you'd really fucking sell it, girl. <sighs> Can you see the damp patch? To be fair, that's like a permanently damp patch. No one ball sweats like Shepard ball sweats. Rose! The Red Rose. That used to be my calling card when I first started out. In place of whatever I took, I left a single Red Rose. That's what it everyone wasn't until else I met in the world that I realized did. how silly it was. He had a way of making you realize when you were just being sentimental. And yet the whole gray box thing you have to sift through all the time you spent to each other? I guess that's a homage to you. Shepard, what the hell are you doing? You just punched her rose and flattened it in the most awkward punchings. <laughs> what the hell was that? That's not a good stance, my friend. I stole that on a dare, believe it or not. There was a big museum show coming to Ilium. Artifacts from Earth going on tour. Very high security. KG dared me to steal this. So I broke in, hacked the security, put a few guards to sleep, and replaced the piece with a worthless duplicate. They never knew the difference. My first museum job. No See, one either last. Rakesh Rangan? Is that a really weird Ronald Reaganing? Out of absolute, like, who is this meant to be? Is this a character in a Bioware game that I just don't know? Okay. Whatever. It's a pretty, pretty fine bust. Congratulations on your bust, Kasumi. It's lovely. Very, uh, 
Uh, uh, uh, uh, Shepard's Shepard's getting damp again, but for very different reasons. Painting. That's my favorite piece, painted for me by a child prodigy. That's not piss. That's not piss. She was the cutest thing. She was kidnapped by slavers who hoped to sell her on Omega. I wasn't about to let that happen. I set up an idea as a buyer. Okay, so I was about to say Shepard's releasing the white we, and then she talked about the child slave, and I I feel dirty. I I feel like that's not. A time that I want to say that, but I also feel like white we deserves to be immortalized forever, and I'm really proud of myself. So we're gonna say it now. We're gonna get all that laughing out of our systems, all of our systems, potentially all the piss, get all the white we out of our systems, and we're gonna go back to child slavery, commencing now. <laughs> ha oh, oh, ha! Oh, really funny joke, Edge Strike HD. Ah, uh, okay. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. Are you guys done? Tell me when you're done. Congratulations on your bust, Kasumi. Weird way of complimenting a woman's tits, but sure. That's what I was going with, Jamie. I'm glad you picked up on it. <laughs> I was really hoping someone was gonna get there. Oh, 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 we're funny, funny lads. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Child slavery. Here we come. Special tour of the slaver's vessel. Once aboard. I freed the girl and smuggled her off the ship. She painted that for me on the way home. I'll never forget how it felt to watch her work. Wow. Wow. It looks... Well, I don't know. Now that I look at it, it looks kind of shit. But I really like the story. There's something about it that means I would hang it in my house. But it's just kind of a circle made of triangles. That's, that's about all we got here. Congratulations! Yeah! Yeah! The benefits of child slavery, everyone! Coming at you live on the Edge Strike ADHD's channel. Don't laugh, Hello, I like those books. Romance novels, crime novels, the classics. There's something about the feel of actual paper in your hands, their musty smell. It's relaxing. KJ used to find books for me while on the job. It's so cute! Some of these are more valuable than the objects he was hired to steal. Holy shit, seriously, what do you got? The last roommate. What the hell have we done to. Shepard? Shepard? <laughs> Side eyeing Kasubi's bust for the last time on the way to his books. Whoa! Oh, you look truly disgusting today, sir! Holy fuck! It's the thumbnail for the entire series. I, I'll, I'll gladly just sit here and look at that forever. His face, I know! <laughs> what an abomination have I created! By the way, by the way, his scarring is getting less and less the more we go. He had a horrible one over this eyebrow until really recently. It's, excuse me, bitch, <laughs> exactly. Oh no, that's, that's really horrible. He's got, he's still thinking about like child slaves in the worst way. And that's Shepard. Shepard, no. That's not what we're here for, buddy! No! Only adult slaves are allowed on this ship. Ah, uh, because I don't think we're paying anyone. It's not my fault. So I was trying to photo mode these books and work out what they are. Oh good, do you guys like... By... What about... No, that's the exact same one. He's got multiple copies of... By... Can I read that one? It just looks like... Bluv, and then everything else is like scratched out. The bluv is the only part that matters. Thanks, night <laughs> Yeah, that was that was the time. That's that's my that's my finest work. That's what Nightbot wants you all in on. Is me grunting. <laughs> if you're liking the content, please <laughs> please consider following the stream for more. <laughs> that painting has a special place in my heart. It looks horrifying. An art collector hired me to see it. Looks it looks like Chernobyl. When I got there, the painting was gone. On the way out, I saw it being hauled off by another thief. I chased him down, tackled him, and took the painting. That's you how tackled him? Met. Oh, cute! We never did turn it into our employers. Ah, oh, that's really sweet. That's probably the most important one to you, huh? It's, it, it's giving very big Chernobyl vibes. Except for the fact that I imagine they never got buildings that big, and if they did, they're not intact anymore. Oh, boy. I don't know. I must have got arse blasted by a very large spider, though. I mean, that's that's a, that's a good bit of spider spray. Oof. Can I interact with anything else? Kasumi? No, I mean, we can talk to her, I guess. People are talking out there. And 
I hear it all. Oh yeah, you're just cryptic and weird, aren't you? She will sometimes comment on shit that she shouldn't know about, though, I believe. Uh, she's really interesting to come and talk about when, like, she will often inform you of things that are about to happen in the story, but quite a bit early. Or, like, she'll give you details on other people's loyalty missions, even if they haven't come up and I stuff like that. I usually travel hidden away in cargo bays. But I think it's she nice has to spend to more time with the crew to do that. Change. And I think she does it more the more people Mess she Sergeant comes out Sergeant Wagner might just be an evil genius. Emphasis on the evil. People think he's a bad cook on purpose, like he's trying to teach them a lesson. I think his ramen is okay, but it's really hard to ruin ramen. He's making ramen? This guy is fucking trying, what the hell? He's like the most redneck, like, meat-headed idiot I've ever ran into in my life. And he's making fine fucking oat cuisine. Does anyone really ever sure say that? Do I don't even know myself. what that means. Not much call for thievery aboard a ship. Well, feel free to eject yourself out the airlock. I'm not bringing you on many missions, Come trust me. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Alright, gladly. What a, what a really, really polite way of telling me to fuck off. I like it. Wow. I don't even feel bad. I might cry about it later. Few tears. Walnut whip. Little cry. Wank into a flannel. All right. Ah, uh, mess sergeant gun. Commander, those provisions you provided were perfect. I owe you. I've already thrown together some of my calamari gumbo. Here, try a bite. Okay, I guess. I mean, Kasumi's loving a ramen, and she's Japanese, so this can't be too bad. How do you ruin gumbo? I do love me some gumbo. Truth told, it's based on an Asari recipe. Seems a little <laughs> cannibalistic to me with their tentacle heads and all, but they ain't no good grub. There's an anyway, octopus equivalent? Again. Or are they just robbing our through. earth and oceans? Jesus! How can I help you, Commander? Need anything more? You have everything you need. Absolutely. Since you set up my kitchen with proper supplies, thanks again. You really think that's gonna last I forever? I, I bought you, like, one sushi set. I'm surprised you even needed to do anything yourself. It came pre-packed. It was a bento what can box. I do for you? Can we talk? Yeah, Finally. Minute, Miranda. There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another Fuck time. you. Of course, Commander. She's really fun. She's really intro. Oh, <laughs> he broke his neck again. Cooper, there's something different with tonight's meal. Seems like you put in more food and less ass. Oh, you yeah, got him. Keep talking. <laughs> He's really cute. I didn't know his name was Rupert. Rupert Gardner. Why are they constantly fucking with this guy who's like just had a dead family for all this time? He's just... He is the arse of everyone's joke at this point. <sighs> this poor man. This poor man, he deserves better. Don't worry. I will give all that I am to make sure that these people learn their fucking lesson, messy gardener. Right, is there any... Th who did I miss him? We now have Kasuma. I nearly left without Garrus. I forget he's like, oh, he's really annoying to get to. He's all the way down this fucking hall. Shepard has more than enough fucking cardio for one day, Garrus. I need the infinite sprint mod because this is killing me. Shepard, need me for something? Uh, I want to talk. Please, oh God, let me talk. Us clenched in overdrive. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Us is released, but the disappointment is never ending. Talk to you oh my years. god, that's plugged me all the way up. I love you, calibrations, but if I have to hear it one more time, instead of more and more and more of the juiciest Garrus based words, then I, I just. I don't know if I'll ever survive. I don't know if we're coming back from that one. That hurt. That truly broke me deep. Uh, right, we've spoken to Jacob and Morden, they had nothing. Hang out with Zaid? I don't think we really need to. I think it's time to leave. Uh, we just left Omega for like the second time. I don't want to deal with the Patriarch until we go and pick up, uh, a certain Warlord. <laughs> As the game seems to be putting it right now, at the very least. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Now, I am ignoring a decent amount there as well in the Omega Nebula, uh, because we still, uh, I want to get Tali before we explore the Normandy crash site, so there's no point going and hanging out in the rest of that, um, solar system before I get to do everything there, it's gonna be a waste of fucking fuel. So where do I even want to go now? Whoa, the Serpent Nebula just got huge? Why did the Serpent Nebula just get fucking huge? And I could do two loyalty missions immediately. I kinda wanna. 
I got of really into that. I kind of really- Oh, I love this mission really high, but I think it might take a while. How long have we got? Two hours? We could! We honestly could, but I don't- You know what? This is all gonna take a while. Zaid shouldn't take too long. And that way we can be done with him and not really have to drag him out that much more. I like Zaid. He's really cool and I will be taking him on missions down the line just because I will be cycling through absolutely fucking everyone. There is no one in this game that I don't like to an extent. Like, Zaid has some of the coolest fucking dialogue just in his own cabin in the whole fucking game. I love it. Unfortunately, we've just mostly been through all of it. Say more, please. Play only Australian, I care about Miranda that clearly doesn't love me and never ever will. The cold bitch. Alright, let's get out of here.